today we are making, you want to tell them what we're making? Marshmallow s'more pretzels. Pretzel s'mores, yay. Okay, so what you need, sorry, I thought you there. What you will need are some chocolate bars. We just have little mini and Hershey's pretzels. bars. Little pretzels. And pretzels and marshmallows, of course. And little marshmallows. And what you're going to do is move this over here so you can see a little bit better. Take two pretzels nope. and put it Not on. yet. Not yet. Hold on. Okay, one pretzel. You got your pretzel? Mm -hmm. All right. You need three marshmallows. Mm. I got my three. We'll put one in each of the holes. Just lay it on there. You don't have to stuff it in there. Just I like stuffing mine in there. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> so we put three marshmallows in the little holes of the pretzel. And then we're going to break our chocolate bar and put a little rectangle of chocolate on top. And we're going to continue doing this. And then we're going to take it, when we're done, we're going to take this plate and we're going to heat them in the microwave for 5 to 10 seconds and until the marshmallows get poofy and the ch you see the edges of the chocolate start to melt and then we'll take them out and put the other pretzels on top. If That's you a lot want, of chocolate. You can put two chocolates on if you like. You can. You like. Yeah, but we're going to make some more. So let's save the chocolate for some more. Okay. Here, let's keep making them. Keep making them. Marshmallows. Mm, this looks good. I'm pretty excited about these. Are you excited about these? Mm -hmm. I am really excited about these. If you want less marshmallow, what you can do is you can put the chocolate bar down first and then put two marshmallows on top of it. So you go like this chocolate and then put the two marshmallows just side by side on top of that. I did find when microwaving them like this it takes a little bit longer. I'm not sure why that is but it takes a little bit longer for the marshmallows to poof up and the chocolate to get melty so you'll want to add a few seconds if you're doing it that way. But we're going to keep on creating our pretzels and we'll be back to show you what they look like after they've been microwaved. You're right, they are quick. Yeah, that was super quick. So it only took us, we did maybe like 11 to 13 seconds. And now we're going to take our second pretzel and press it into the top. Um, you don't have to use two pretzels if you don't want to. It will just make it a little less messy and it's kind of like a sandwich that way. Some of them do tip over and melt at different paces too in the microwave. So there might be some that you want to put back in after. How is it? Good? Mm -hmm. Looks good. All right. Well, we are going to enjoy these and we hope that you enjoy yours. And we will see you next time. Yeah, I'm not real fun. Bye.